good morning students today in this class we will discuss about the your sixth class chapter that is motion and measurements so we are discussing motion and measurements chapter so what we are discussing in this chapter so initially we discussed that how people used to travel or what are the source of motion in the earlier days in the earlier days before the wheel is invented so the people used to travel by their legs they used the animals when the wheel is invented they started using the carts okay and after that what happened invention of petrol train was taken before that train was uh, came into existence before that train uh, bike was there cycle they used first and after that petrol engine and diesel engine developed bike they started using bike and scooters and after that train came into existence and bus and after that finally uh, aeroplane came into existence so that all we discussed but believe me before these things were discussed so uh, man was used to measure the measurement by his uh, fingers length foot length okay suppose i want to measure this okay if the table is there okay this is the table so if i want to measure the length of this table i will use my uh, what we can say mm, fingers i will do like this four fingers again four fingers eight fingers 12 fingers like this okay but is our finger size is same all the way no it is different okay sometimes we use less finger sometimes the person is having the length of the finger is very less sometimes the person is having the length of the finger is more so that is why let us perform some activities here so all of you open page number 90 97 that is some measurements activity 1 okay so what is there work in groups and each of you do this activity one by one you have to be in groups and each of you have to do this activity one by one okay using your foot as a unit of length measure the length and breadth of the classroom using your foot as a unit of length measure the length and breadth of the classroom if there are two classroom if there is a classroom we have to measure the length and breadth so here it is a classroom i can measure it by my foot length but when you come to school definitely we will perform this activity so in your home also you can do uh, only length of one room better you don't do you are uh, no don't do that better we will do in classroom okay so that um, measure unit of length measure the length and breadth of classroom it is possible that while measuring this you may find some parts remains be measured as it is smaller than your foot see measure madodne gen agutade new measure madko thoda last gen uritadra ad foot kintalu kadime irabodu so if it is less than foot it is again difficult okay right so with some noun quantity this noun quantity fixed quantity is called a unit this noun fixed quantity sorry uh, where i left okay Use a string to measure the length of a part of your foot as you did before. Record your observation in Table Ten Point One. See that foot. Use a foot. You should measure it by foot length. And if it is less than foot length, last real is less than foot length. Space will be done. That time, what you have to do? You have to measure it by the strings. ದಾರವನ್ನು ತಗೊಂಡು ಮೇಜರ್ ಮಾಡಬೇಕು ಓಕೆ ಆ ಟೈಮ್ ಅಲ್ಲಿ ದಾರವನ್ನು ತೆಗೆದುಕೊಂಡು ಮೇಜರ್ ಮಾಡಬೇಕು ಎಸ್ ನಾವು ವಿಲ್ ಗೋ ಟು ಆಕ್ಟಿವಿಟಿ ಟು ವರ್ಕ್ ಇನ್ ಅ ಗ್ರೂಪ್ ಅಂಡ್ ಈಚ್ ಆಫ್ ಯು ಯೂಸ್ ಯುವರ್ ಹ್ಯಾಂಡ್ ಸ್ಪ್ಯಾನ್ ಆಸ್ ಅ ಯುನಿಟ್ ಟು ಮೇಜರ್ ದ ವಿಡ್ತ್ ಆಫ್ ಅ ಟೇಬಲ್ ಆರ್ ಅ ಡೆಸ್ಕ್ ಇನ್ ದ ಕ್ಲಾಸ್ ರೂಮ್ ಸೊ ಯು ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಟು ವರ್ಕ್ ಇನ್ ಅ ಗ್ರೂಪ್ and each of you use your hand span as a unit to measure the width of a table or a desk in the classroom in the classroom width of a table or a desk should be measured here too you may find that you need string lengths equal to your hand span and then fraction of the string lengths to make the measurement 
so you have to use your hand to make the string length like this okay one table ready we go in the bottom of the bar you money will get it I literally know some other it you know what it will go to the I even knew hang a new one do if you are playing goalie and all okay we will consider this game okay the game and the camera like this okay so we will measure like this okay what we do in our game is the distance between the two goalies we don't have scale there to use to measure so what we used to did we used to use our hands like one gain one chota so we used to do that so that is way you have to think okay then okay hmm? here to you may find that you need you need string lengths equal to your hand span and then fractions of the string length make to make the measurement so you have to record all the observation here also it is difficult sometimes if uh, very less uh, space is there then we use our uh, fingers suppose if there is difference between these two goalies okay if i say one length okay or you can use from left hand if i do like this it is remaining so that remaining part i have to measure by fingers three fingers okay like that but the problem is everyone is not having the same length of the hand the foot length will change uh, hand length will change somebody is having more somebody is having less so that is why we all need a some unit of measurement that we can see there we see that measurement means the comparison of unknown quantity with some known quantity see measurement is what we are speaking about this measurement what is measurement so measurement means it is the comparison comparison of unknown quantity and known quantity unknown quantity and and known quantity and known quantity measurement means comparison of unknown quantity and known quantity okay see in always a measurement there is two parts one part is a number one part second part that is one part is number and the second part is one part is number and second part is unit suppose if i say 30 km okay if i say 30 km 30 is a number this is a number kilometer is unit okay if i say 10 meter 10 is a number meter is unit if I say measurements, uh, weight we are measuring, if it is say 50 kg, 50 is a number, magnitude, kg is its unit. Okay, so always remember, it should be a number and unit. There must be a number and unit. Okay, if you, if you were found that in when you measure the classroom, if you found that this 12 foot lengths okay so before these comes okay these all came now before these coming if you measure your classroom if it is found to be 12 foot length okay then what we have to say is 12 is a number foot length is unit isn't it 12 is a number foot length is a unit so there will be a mina measurement there will be number first after that there will be what unit so that unit is foot length here quantity is there so we have come across this one part is number second part is unit okay Yes. Now study all the measurements recorded in table 10.1 and 10.2 or all the measurements for the room using everybody's foot equal. See here. So if you study that measurement by foot length or measurement by hand, measurement by fingers, width of the fingers, 
See, we cannot say that they all are same for the every person. For example, if a person is having more height, usually he will be having the length of his foot is more. So the same classroom for him will be those if normal person wears if it is tall foot lengths for him it might comes it might come eleven foot lengths. Okay, for more uh, for less foot length person it might come thirteen foot length. So it is not same for every person. Okay, the length of the foot is different for different person. We cannot say that the length of the foot is same for all the persons. Can we say like that? No, it is not possible. Okay, new father the one length the indra, new father the father length in the classroom mother in Korea. On the hundred foot one, Nimikin the loo Yatri down the father the length in the tea, Hatcher the tea. I'm one of the pretty birthday, hundred foot birthday. I come around Hatcher the father length. Nimkit the father length, pretty with the one, son would have the more than a cat of the bandandra. I was here chucked the tea. So, it is not confirmed that foot length is same for all. So, that is why this unit of measurement cannot be considered. So, we therefore finally we came that hand span or foot. See, we these are not the proper measurements what we can say. We see that some standard units of measurement are needed that do not change from person to person. So, we are going to see that some standard units of measurement are needed which should not change from person to person. They should not change from person to person. See, some standard units are needed but they are not supposed to change from person to person. Away na bardu, person to person na change aag bardu. Okay, person to person away na bardri, change aag bardri. Three three, hori, mundo kundri. Yes, page number ninety nine. Standard units of measurement. Okay, in any same time the length of a foot, the width of a finger. And the distance of a step were commonly used as different units of measurement. You know this. Initial times in the sense early times. Length of foot, width of finger, distance of a step were commonly used. See distance of a step, length of foot and width of a finger. They were commonly used. Okay. Why they were commonly used? Because that time no scale was there. So the distance should be measured by these things only. Pada the Arthur Beku, Ila Yerado, Pada the Nadabrikan Antra, Yats, Cricket Pitch of Hungar to the Mazana was an Ida Hungar TV, Cricket Ard with Nayan Marti, twenty two yards and TV. What do we call it as twenty two yards? Okay, so we use we use our foot different for twenty two yards and we measure that, isn't it? So, but now they have not done that, they consider it as a twenty two meter. So every meter they will consider it as a add. Okay. So initially, what are the measurements before the uh, uh, units of measurement came into existence? Distance of a step, length of a foot, and width of a finger. Width of a finger, distance of a step, length of a foot were commonly used as measurements. The people of the Indus Valley civilization must have used very good measurements of length because we see evidence in execution of perfectly geometrical constructions. See, there were ancient times, Indus Valley Civilization, you might have heard this in uh, history. Okay, Indus Valley Civilization, Sindhu Nagari Kate. So, they might have used some good measurements because in excavations, that means, or we can say now, our uh, Smaraka, our Vinyasa, our so, in that we can see that there are proper measurements. They have properly built. They have properly created the sculptures. Vrena Vandu Vastu Shilpa, proper I create it. That's why our Padiuli Kigali, our Hind Madrita Kanta work early, properness of that. So, other now, more go. A cubit is as the length from the elbow to the fingertips was used in ancient Egypt and also accepted as unit of length in other parts of the world. See, cubit length from the elbow to the fingertips. See, this length from the 
ಎಲ್ಲ ಇಲ್ಲಿ ಅದಲ್ಲ ಇಲ್ಲಿ ಅಂದ್ರೆ ಇಲ್ಲಿ ಬಿಟ್ಟು ಒಂದ್ ಮಳ ಹಾಕಿದ್ವಿ ನಾವು ಹಿಂಗಚ್ಚಿವಿ ಇಲ್ಲ ಒಂದ್ ಮಳ ಓಕೆ ಅದಕ್ಕೆ ಇಂಗ್ಲೀಷ್ ಆಗಿ ಕ್ಯೂಬಿಟ್ ಅಂತ ಅರ್ಥ ಸೊ ದಿಸ್ ವಾಸ್ ಅರ್ಲಿಯರ್ ಯೂಸ್ಡ್ ಇನ್ ಈಜಿಪ್ಟ್ ಈಜಿಪ್ಟ್ ಒಳಗೆ ಹಿಂಗ್ ಮೇಜರ್ ಮಾಡ್ಲಿಕ್ಕೆ ಬಳಸ್ತಿದ್ರು ತಪ್ಪು ತಿಳ್ಕೊಬೇಡ್ರಿ ಹಿಂಗೆ ಇದನ್ನ ಓಕೆ ಸೊ ದಿಸ್ ಈಸ್ ವಾಟ್ ವಿ ಕ್ಯಾನ್ ಸೇ ಒನ್ ಮಳ ಓಕೆ ಒಂದ್ ಮಳ ಹೂ ಕೊಡತ್ತಾರೆ ಈಗ ಅದ್ರ ಏನಾದ್ರು ಯೂಸ್ ಮಾಡ್ತೀವಿ ನಾವು ಎಲ್ಲರೂ ಹೋದಾಗ ಸೊ ಒಂದ್ ಮೊಳ ಹೂ ಕೊಡ್ರಿ ಅಂತ ಹೂ ತರ ಆಗ್ತದಾಗ ಸೊ ಅವ್ರು ಒಂದ್ ಮೊಳ ಅಂದ್ರೆ ಹಿಂಗ್ ಸೆಂಟಿಮೀಟರ್ ಎಳೆಯುದಿಲ್ಲ ದೇ ವಿಲ್ ಯೂಸ್ ದರ್ ಹ್ಯಾಂಡ್ ಸ್ಟಿಲ್ ಇಟ್ ಇಸ್ ದೇರ್ ಸೊ ಫ್ರಮ್ ದ ಎಲ್ಬೋ ಫಿಂಗರ್ ಮಿಡಲ್ ಆಫ್ ದ ಎಲ್ಬೋ ಟು ಫಿಂಗರ್ ಟ್ಯೂಬ್ ಓಕೆ ಇಟ್ ಇಸ್ ಕಾಲ್ಡ್ ಕ್ಯೂಬಿಟ್ ಇನ್ ಇಂಗ್ಲಿಷ್ ಓಕೆ ಇಟ್ ಇಸ್ ಆಲ್ಸೋ ಎಕ್ಸ್ಪ್ರೆಸ್ ಎಕ್ಸ್ ಪ್ರೆಸ್ಡ್ ಇನ್ ಆಲ್ ಓವರ್ ದ ವರ್ಲ್ಡ್ ಪೀಪಲ್ ಆಲ್ಸೋ ಯೂಸ್ ದ ಫುಡ್ ಆಸ್ ಅ ಯೂನಿಟ್ ಆಫ್ ಲೆಂಗ್ತ್ ಇನ್ ಡಿಫರೆಂಟ್ ಪಾರ್ಟ್ಸ್ ಆಫ್ ದ ವರ್ಲ್ಡ್ ದ ಲೆಂಗ್ತ್ ಆಫ್ ದ ಫುಡ್ ಯೂಸ್ಡ್ ವೆರಿ ಇಸ್ ಲೈಕ್ಲಿ ಫ್ರಮ್ ರೀಜನ್ ಟು ರೀಜನ್ ಸಿ ಪೀಪಲ್ ಆಲ್ಸೋ ಯೂಸ್ ದ ಫುಡ್ ಆಸ್ ಅ ಯೂನಿಟ್ ಆಫ್ ಲೆಂಗ್ತ್ ಪೀಪಲ್ ಆಲ್ಸೋ ಯೂಸ್ ಫುಡ್ ಫುಡ್ ಅನ್ನ ಯೂನಿಟ್ ಆಫ್ ಲೆಂಗ್ತ್ ಆಗಿ ಜನ ಯೂಸ್ ಮಾಡಿದ್ರು ಇನ್ ಡಿಫರೆಂಟ್ ಪಾರ್ಟ್ಸ್ ಆಫ್ ವರ್ಲ್ಡ್ ದ ಲೆಂಗ್ತ್ ಆಫ್ ದ ಫುಡ್ ಯೂಸ್ ವೆರಿ ಇಟ್ಸ್ ಲೈಕ್ಲಿ ಫ್ರಮ್ ರೀಜನ್ ಟು ರೀಜನ್ ಲೆಂಗ್ತ್ ಆಫ್ ದ ಫುಡ್ ಏನ್ ಯೂಸ್ ಮಾಡಿದ್ರಲ್ಲ ಇಟ್ ಇಸ್ ವೆರಿ ಇಟ್ಸ್ ಲೈಕ್ಲಿ ಫ್ರಮ್ ರೀಜನ್ ಟು ರೀಜನ್ ಸೊ ರಿಮೇನಿಂಗ್ ಥಿಂಗ್ಸ್ ವಿ ವಿಲ್ ಸಿ ಇನ್ ದ ನೆಕ್ಸ್ಟ್ ಕ್ಲಾಸ್ ದಿಸ್ ಇಸ್ ಲಿಟಲ್ ಬಿಟ್ ಥೆರೋಟಿಕಲ್ ಚಾಪ್ಟರ್ ದಟ್ ಇಸ್ ವೈ ಐ ಆಮ್ ಟೆಲ್ಲಿಂಗ್ ಲೈನ್ ಬೈ ಲೈನ್ ಓಕೆ ಐ ಆಮ್ ಟೆಲ್ಲಿಂಗ್ ಲೈನ್ ಬೈ ಲೈನ್ ಬಿಕಾಸ್ ದಿಸ್ ಇಸ್ ಕಂಪ್ಲೀಟ್ಲಿ ಥೆರೋಟಿಕಲ್ ಚಾಪ್ಟರ್ ದಟ್ ಇಸ್ ವೈ ಐ ಆಮ್ ಗೋಯಿಂಗ್ ಥ್ರೂ ಲೈನ್ ಬೈ ಲೈನ್ ದೆನ್ ಓನ್ಲಿ ವಿಲ್ ಅಂಡರ್ಸ್ಟ್ಯಾಂಡ್ ಅದರ್ವೈಸ್ ಇಫ್ ಐ ಟೆಲ್ ಇನ್ ಸಿಂಗಲ್ ಇನ್ ಸಿಂಗಲ್ ವಿಡಿಯೋ ದ ಚಾಪ್ಟರ್ ವಿಲ್ ಫಿನಿಶ್ ಇಫ್ ಐ ಟೆಲ್ ಓನ್ಲಿ ಕಾನ್ಸೆಪ್ಟ್ಸ್ ಓಕೆ ದಟ್ ಇಸ್ ವೈ ಐ ಆಮ್ ಟೆಲ್ಲಿಂಗ್ ಲೈನ್ ಬೈ ಲೈನ್ ಸೊ ಯು ಕ್ಯಾನ್ ಅಂಡರ್ಸ್ಟ್ಯಾಂಡ್ ಎವ್ರಿಥಿಂಗ್ ಓಕೆ ವಿ ವಿಲ್ ಸಿ ದ ರಿಮೇನಿಂಗ್ ಥಿಂಗ್ಸ್ ಇನ್ ದ ನೆಕ್ಸ್ಟ್ ಕ್ಲಾಸ್ ಥ್ಯಾಂಕ್ ಯು